our tutorial Fama French three factors model. Asset pricing models consist of estimating asset expected return through its expected risk premium linear relationship with factors portfolios expected risk premiums and macroeconomic factors. This topic is part of investment portfolio analysis with our course. Feel free to take a look at course curriculum by clicking link at the description box below. This tutorial has an educational and informational purpose and doesn't constitute any type of trading or investment advice. Please read full tutorial disclaimer at the end of this video. Fama French three factors model consists of estimating asset expected return through its expected risk premium linear relationship with market expected risk premium, size and investment style factors portfolios expected returns. Size factor corresponds to long small stocks portfolio and short big stocks portfolio. Investment style factor corresponds to long value stocks portfolio and short growth stocks portfolio. Value corresponds to high book to market stock ratio and growth corresponds to low book to market stock ratio. Book to market stock ratio corresponds to shareholders equity per share divided by market value per share. For full reference, I recommend that you read Eugene Fama and Kenneth French, Common Risk Factors in the Returns of Stocks and Bonds, published in the Journal of Financial Economics in 1992. As a formula, we have the expected asset return equals to the expected risk-free rate of return plus a beta-1 coefficient multiplied by the difference between the expected market return minus the expected risk-free rate of return plus a beta-2 coefficient multiplied by the expected small minus big portfolio return plus a beta-3 coefficient multiplied by the expected high minus low portfolio return. Small minus big portfolio is equal to 1 divided by 3 multiplied by small value plus small neutral plus small growth portfolios minus 1 divided by 3 multiplied by big value plus big neutral plus big growth portfolios. High minus low portfolio is equal to 1 divided by 2 multiplied by a small value plus big value portfolios minus 1 divided by 2 multiplied by small growth plus big growth portfolios. Great, so let's go into R Studio so that we can study FEMA French three factors model with greater detail. Perfect. So here we are within R Studio. In this tutorial, we'll be working within R Tutorial Fama French Three Factors Model Call File. So the first step within the tutorial is to load its packages. This is done with a library function, and in this tutorial, we'll be using XTS. So we select the code line there, then we click Run or Ctrl Enter on the keyboard, which is equivalent. The following step is to create data for Fama French Three Factors Model Calculation. So we create an object named returns, which is equal to read.csv, and within it we have the name of the data file, Fama French three factors models data, as a plain text file with .csv or comma separated values and stored within the working directory, comma header equals to true. So we select the code line and then we click run or Ctrl enter on the keyboard. Notice that this creates a returns object within the global environment as a data frame. And if we click on the spreadsheet kind of icon, This opens the data for us. So we have high columns of data. First of this, dates, dates with a monthly frequency from the beginning of 2007 all the way to the end of 2016, therefore 10 years of data. Then we have SPY.RF, which corresponds to the asset risk premium. The asset SPY, which corresponds to the ETF investment vehicle, which intends to replicate the Standard & Poor's 500 index. Therefore here we have SPY monthly arithmetic returns minus the corresponding month risk-free rate of return for the asset risk premium. Then we have mkt.rf, which corresponds to the market risk premium. Therefore, here we have the market portfolio monthly arithmetic returns minus the corresponding month risk free rate of return for the market risk premium. And then here we have SMB, which stands for small minus big. Therefore, here we have monthly arithmetic returns of small minus big portfolio. And then we have HML, which stands for high minus low. Therefore, here we have the monthly arithmetic returns of the high minus low portfolio. So back into the code file, the following step here is we are going to convert that data from a data frame to an XTS or extensible time series. So we override returns as an XTS and from returns we select from columns 2 to 5 from the corresponding risk premiums, asset and market, together with the small minus big and high minus low portfolios. 
comma. Order by equals as date, capital D, returns the first column with those dates. So we select the code line there, then click, click run or control enter on the keyboard. So if we reopen the data here, as we can see, we have the same data, but now the dates became its index. So back into the code file, once we have the data ready, we're going to continue with FAMA French three factors models calculation. This will be done through linear regression. So here we're going to print the summary of that linear regression, which is done with LM, which stands for linear model. And within it, we have SPY.RF, which is the asset risk premium. That's the dependent or explained variable being explained by MKT.RF, which is the market risk premium plus SMB, which stands for small minus big portfolio plus HML, which stands for high minus low portfolio. All of this, the independent or explanatory variables and the data is equal to that returns object. So we select that code line there, then we click run or control enter on the keyboard, which is equivalent. And notice that the result has been printed within the console. So if we scroll up here, we see the corresponding summary of that linear regression with the corresponding formula. And specifically, we focus right here on the coefficients and the estimates here. So the first of this, which is at the intercept, that intercept corresponds to the asset average realized excess return according to FAMA French three factors model. Then we have the beta one coefficient related to that market. Then we have the market risk premium. Then we have the beta two coefficient related to the small minus big portfolio. And then we have the beta three coefficient related to the high minus low portfolio. Excellent. So now that we finished studying FAMA French three factors model, let's go back into the slides. And as mentioned previously, this tutorial has an educational and informational purpose and doesn't constitute any type of trading or investment advice. Please pause the video now so you can read the full tutorial disclaimer. Okay, so with this, we finish this tutorial. Thank you for watching.